Welcome back. If you have back problems or general body aches, you've probably been for a massage once or twice in your lifetime. Uh, this is a new concept for massage. It's called Thai Massage. New to me because I've never tried it before, but it's being offered in Kamloops now. It's called Kamloops Thai Massage. We have Cyrune joining us today, Cyrune Singer, who is the masseuse, the Thai Massage Specialist. It's great to have you here. And your husband, Tim. It's great to have the both of you here today. Thank you. Yes. So you approached me about coming on the show because Thai Massage is something a lot of people don't know about and then you invited me to come and try a massage which I did yesterday we have some pictures actually of me getting a massage which we can show um, but the first one is me after the massage I look quite relaxed <laughs> um, but it was amazing experience but uh, it's something that's a little bit different than your average massage how would you ex explain it like for me I would say it's about a lot of pressure points mm. well it's pressure release and, and it's really um, I can't compare it to other modalities because I've never actually had those, but I've just had a ton of Thai massages because my wife is from Thailand and obviously we've been there a number of times. Um, but it just, it really helps, especially with different blockages and, and especially if somebody's got just a nagging sports injury or something that just won't go away. They're really trained in the physiology and, and really how to get in there nice and deep. And, and of course, you know, she looks very small, but she's also very powerful. So yes, she is. She'll only go as far as she thinks that she can take you right. uh, unless she's getting your permission. But she really, really helped me because I had some major back issues. You were at the point with your back where you weren't able to walk properly. Yeah. And then you had this type of therapy done on you and you're now feeling great yeah I mean my um, I had a CT scan and I've got you know a number of degenerative things that are getting worse over time so I'm gonna have surgery but um, you know the pain was so bad my right foot is still numb but I don't have the pain anymore I got off all the medications uh, basically when I got to Thailand I didn't have to take anymore at the beginning of uh, December so it's just fantastic I mean the medications were great because they reduced the pain mm -hmm. but um, not having to take them is even better Cyrun, you were in Thailand and were trained there. You returned, you're from Thailand, you met your husband there, you came here, many years later you went back and trained in this. What, what is it called? What kind of training is it called? Um, it's called, uh, I was trained in, uh, they call Wat Po. Wat Po. Um, um, the medical massage school. Mm -hmm. It's been uh, around for a couple hundred years. All right, so it's not new, but it's sort of not as well known in the Western culture, would be a good way to say. Yes. So you were trained there, and then you've brought this back here. Um, and I know that you've had really good experience so far with the people that you have, have tried it on. Yes, um, yeah, yeah. yeah. P, um, I, I, I used to work in a um, home, um, like um, hospital, and I saw a lot of people get hurt, and I know that um, uh, massage, you know, can help them, can help people. So that's why I thought it's, it's you know, I, I would like to go back and, and learn and, and help people in Kamloops, you know. Mm -hmm. And so now you're doing that. Yeah. And what I really notice about it is there's one minute where you're very relaxed, you're getting this massage, and then it becomes almost not painful, but you're pushing on these pressure points and that release feels fantastic. And I feel quite good today. <laughs> I do, I feel quite relaxed today. <laughs> but uh, like your husband said, it's true. You're, you're small, but you have very strong hands and, and you sort of know how far to take somebody, which I guess is crucial. You have to know where to sort of hold off and not go too far. Right, right, yeah. yeah. Um, the thing is when, like, when people that had bad back issues, so you, I can't just go work right on their back because mm -hmm. going, they're going to have other parts of their muscle that have been working so hard to take all the pressure. So I have to gently work on a surround area first and then go to this, the spot that they told me they have pain there, right? Right. So that's that how the Thai massage works, pressure point release. So we go release or they take a point and then you know hopefully that they will feel better and so it's about uh, uh, several sessions you can only do so much in one session you have to sort of work on somebody as you go exactly yes fantastic yeah, yeah. So and it does depend also like if somebody wants to come for a relaxation massage mm -hmm. there's oil massage and aromatherapy yes mm -hmm. but but generally people are coming because they've got you know whether it's stress issues or or knots in their neck or migraines or, or you know uh, mm -hmm. back is obviously um, very common but um, leg pain 
joint pain, that type of stuff. Mm -hmm. So I had like the full body massage yesterday and then the foot massage. Both were fabulous. It was very relaxing and I highly recommend it. I really enjoyed it. So we are just about out of time, but I wanted to say thank you to the both of you for coming on today. Um, but also, if you would like to learn more about this, uh, so many people suffer from back pain and body pain. CountsTimeMassage.com is where you can go online to check out what they have to offer. They're also on Facebook at Kamloops Time Massage. Absolutely worth checking into, very worth it. We're back in 30 seconds, stay with us.